सो हाय हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू आर लेट्स नो वाई सीरीज टुडे आई एम बैक विद अ डिफरेंट इंटरेस्टिंग क्लिनिकल सिनेरियो सो लेट्स मूव ऑन सो दिस इज एन इमेज ऑफ अ ट्वेंटी इयर ओल्ड गर्ल हु वॉज एडमिटेड इन द एमरजेंसी इन व्यू ऑफ altered mental status as well as high grade fever and the attendant told that she had an episode of seizure some 3 hours before she was comatose at the time of examination her gcs was too low and basic reflexes were normal and light reflexes were normal then we tried for a lumbar puncture in which csf analysis was perfectly normal no abnormalities could be found but at the same time diffusion weighted mri was done for her in that we are finding hyperintense lesions over the bilateral gray matter as well as over the cerebral hemi cerebellar hemispheres and pons okay so on inquiring further about the history that an installed she had some severe episodes of loose stools with blood mixed some 10 days before and she was having lower abdominal pain also and associated with fever so what they did was they took her to a nearby local hospital in which she received some antibiotics and some iv fluids and that will say that after that she was recovering her abdominal pain reduced then what happened 5 days after she received those medications she developed pit pitting pedal edema okay then when checked for a kft her cm creatinine was 2.1 it's alarmingly high for a 20 year old girl then this also re represents that she has oliguria she couldn't pass urine she developed pedal edema and her creat was increasing then her peripheral smear was done in that we were finding cells like this and her platelets assumingly low in hemogram complete hemogram we found her hemoglobin to be 7 grams and platelets to be 80000 okay and counts were normal so yes it's your job now to connect all the pictures what has happened i will narrate once more now in the uh, cause to effect i will narrate first she developed abdominal pain loose stools with blood mixed and then followed by receiving medications then after 5 days she developed pitting pedal edema and kft is deranged oliguria's and peripheral smear abnormalities then after 5 days she developed altered mental sensorium and seizures and high grade fever so in mri it is hyperintense lesions were found so it's your job so i will ask a series of questions now first she received some injection as well as she was done one procedure after which she recovered completely she recovered from her comatose state one thing next can you find any infective cause circulating over here if so comment below the youtube uh, section and detailed discussion of this will be dealt in our whatsapp groups and telegram groups the links is provided in the description so yes that's it for the day if you like this channel you can subscribe it and that's all we'll see tomorrow bye bye